Hello, I am Professor Dean today. I will be showing you a new move. It's uh, something that uh, I never seen anybody do. I tried it out in my yard one day when I made it. Somebody else made it, that's great. You can tell me if uh, not. Who cares? Because I didn't know it existed and I made it for myself. Um, it kind of falls in line with the Autobahn. It's relatively in the same difficult left level. Might be a little more bit higher, but it's like super easy and it resembles a cheat double nine, and I'm sorry all these kids out here are like yelling, and <clears throat> they're really annoying. <clears throat> but it resembles a double nine, a cheat cheat double nine. It's pretty sick, but it's just kind of fun to throw in. When you throw in a combination, it, it, it's kind of confusing looking. Prerequisite is going to be this. I'm really tired and I haven't done nothing, so let me see if I can show you. It's going to be a little skip over, hook, you know, one of these right here. Make sure I don't go to the camera. So just gonna kind of go here. That gay thing, it looked really bad. Okay. Now, it's gonna be the same thing, only instead of coming around with the hook, we're going to first turn the lift leg into a kick. Second, we're, not, we're gonna land on the kick leg. We're not gonna kick with it. We're just gonna come around and throw an inside crescent. So it's gonna kind of look like a double nine. A really bad cheetah double nine. But it's good for flow, and it looks good if you put it together fast. I put some clips together, but my yard's all tore up. I'm real tired. And uh, I just made this move, and I named, I call it the divider. It's called the divider. And you want to know why I call it the divider? I think it's because I just called it that. I didn't have really much of a name, but it divides combinations uh, because it's a divider. Okay. Anyway, the combinations I'm using for this tutorial were all today, and uh, they're not very good. I'm real tired, and my foot's busted up. I already had a three-hour workout today, but I'm still gonna try to show you this move. I like to use a setup. I don't like to just jog in and lift and kick and then come around and then throw another inside crescent. I don't like that. And yes, you can hyper. It's pretty cool. I like using kind of um, like a pump setup that, that's really bad. It's like this. Come in, lift, and then place your pump down. See, in a real cheap double nine, you would jump from here, double nine. Well, in this one, you're just gonna lift for the illusion, put it down, jump, kick. And then do the do the double nine hundred, the whole double nine hundred. <laughs> but we're not gonna do that today. And I don't. That's the setup that I use, which makes it my own technique. Nobody does it, and I made it. As far as I know, I made it for myself. And I'm the one that started using it and using this combination. I think I've seen similar techniques that were swing throughs. Um, but I've never really seen this used by itself like this. And I've never seen this type of a setup. I like to use like a hook. Come in, lift hook, place down, jump, kick, spin all the way around and then throw the second kick. And I'm going to show you now because it's not very difficult. It's going to look something like just stall and then just turn your shoulders and it's real easy to complete. I mean, it's, it's, fair, it's fairly simple. Let me see if I can show you one. That's it. I hope I didn't go out of the range. So that's it. Um, you kind of get an idea. All you're going to do is make your illusion. You can set, do a pump. It's easier, but it doesn't look as cool. And it doesn't flow in combinations. Like come out of 540, and then throw a hook, place it, lift straight up the center line, stall kick, come around. Instead of landing here and throwing this kick, land on this and throw your second. This is the trick that is created by Trickster D and I call it the divider.